WECT News at 5. You remember that song, don't you? You recognize that catchy 90s tune. LaBouche topped the charts with Be My Lover and Sweet Dreams. Well, happening tonight, the group performing right here in Wilmington. Our Ashley Kozlikowski is at the Cape Fear Community College Center's Wilson Center, where LaBouche has a Valentine's Day performance in store. Ashley? Well, Lane McRae is the founder and the vocalist from LaBouche, and you may not realize this, but he was born in Fort Bragg. Thank you so much for joining us Thank on you. WECT News. Thank you for having me. And I was so astounded when I read that about you. How does a young man from uh, Fort Bragg end up in a Euro pop German group? You know, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's a little strange, you know, but you know, my father in the military, in the army, um, of course I went the other way and went in the Air Force uh, and was assigned to Germany. Um, singing in a cover band where I met Melanie and um, she subsequently was working with Frank Farian from Millie Vanilli fame um, and asked me if I wanted to get involved in the LaBouche project. So cool and here you are you had such great hits in the 90s and you're on stage tonight at Cape Fear Community College's Wilson Center with some family members and friends coming to the show tonight. Absolutely, absolutely. And you know, I hope that everyone that comes here will take a little history lesson through, you know, the, the 90s, you know, because it was such a, a prolific time, you know, from music, you know, and uh, movies and things like that. And I'm just really grateful that it's still providing, you know, a uh, source of income for me at this point, you know, this is, it's been 24 years. <laughs> and joy and happiness to others. When yes. we talked about interviewing you today, we all started singing that la da da dee da 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 da. And you yeah. were talking about writing that. How did that come about? Well, if I'm going to be completely transparent, um, <laughs> you know, sometimes when you're working closely together with people, you know, um, as the kids would say, you know, you're, you're catching feelings, you know. And uh, that was the case with me and Melanie. And so I was a little reluctant because I had been in a relationship with someone before and it didn't work out and we had to work with them. It was kind of crazy. So I just kind of slowed my role. And uh, so when we began writing this song, you know, she was like looking back on all the time that we've spent together, you should know by now if you want to be my lover. And I was like, well, you know, I hear what you say. I see what you do, but you know, I need to know a little bit more about you. And, uh, and as I was telling you earlier, you know, the hook in the song, la da 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 was <laughs> just because we couldn't think of any words to put there, so we just, we just left that in there. Now you gotta sing it. <clears throat> la da da dee da 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 See, you killed it. You sound so much better than when I did it. <laughs> and then when anybody in the newsroom you did it. You sounded great. <laughs> Everyone can say that. Well, thank you so much for joining us. And tickets are still available yes. for tonight's show. Yes. So be sure to come out. Enjoy some 90s music that you will just be able to rock out to this evening. The show starts at 730 and tickets are still available. Come on down.